Earlier this week, we told you about Dublin Jerome sophomore Tyler Allfriend, who was diagnosed with lymphoma last November. Tonight at the Dublin Chiller, the Celtics hockey game became part of a fundraiser to help Tyler fight to win. Our Katie Witham joins us with more. Katie. Well, tonight was the first ever Fight to Win fundraiser, which kicked off with a doubleheader of high school hockey. But tonight, the teams are fighting for a different kind of win. The teams of Dublin took action and the ice to help out one of their own. 15-year-old Tyler Allfriend was an athletic and lively high school sophomore. That is until last year when he was diagnosed with stage 4 Burkitt's lymphoma. Since then, he's been undergoing treatments and inspiring others in his own fight to win. It's obviously special to our team because Tyler is a student at Jerome High School and uh, many of the players on our team are, are uh, good friends with him. It feels good, especially since I'm one of his closer friends, and that it feels good to see him, uh, to help him out and uh, be at his side. So this weekend, the Dublin High School Hockey Association designated four varsity hockey games, all going to benefit the Tyler Allfriend Fund. I think it's great that um, the Dublin Hockey Association and uh, the community has really come together to try and help him fight to win. It's just hard to kind of go through some of the stuff he has to deal with. I think it's a great idea just to help him kind of, I don't know, feel like he's not alone. Now there was more to do than just watch the games. Members from Great Clips were in attendance to trim up those who were willing. Signups for a toss for Tyler were also going on. And there was even an auction with sports gear up for grabs, including signed merchandise from the Columbus Blue Jackets. Now all the proceeds from this weekend will go to the Tyler Allfriend Fund. And as you can see, there was a pretty good turnout to help Tyler fight to win tonight. All right.